reasons why I hate this stupid specimen. Okay, let's do this. What is that outfit? Like, it's like bananas in pajamas kind of outfit. What is he wearing? A list acts my ass when he can't even afford a stylist and walks around like that all fucking day. You've got to be shitting me. And he's also just ugly in general. Like, I think Ginger is the least of his problems. No, he's just ugly, like, in general. His hair is probably the best thing about him, honestly. Um, yeah, he's ugly as fuck. Like, what are those eyebrows, man? Even as a kid, he was annoying. What is that ugly ass jacket monster? The movie monster. He's such a fucking neek. Also, this is Sun. He, his spawn is a fucking demon baby and possibly the most annoying minor story antagonist ever. Oh my god, I hate him so much. I would punch him in the face. His whole family bloodline just deserves to burn. It blows my mind now of all of first gen. It was Hero Huger that was the one that got pussy. As well as Kasumi, but that's that's a different thing because at least Kasumi's nice. Like Hero genuinely someone wanted his dick. Like what the fuck? <laughs> and now it's gonna be like main story spoilers, so if you haven't seen it, then click off now. <laughs> the first time this man sees this literal eighteen year old, like a child like barely an adult he just starts going at him for like no reason and it's like why why he he's never met you he's never talked to you he's never done anything to you what is your problem like he was giving digs at Tema for that hero show thing that he did that he got from his parents and like then he gives him mixed signals with like his son and then you know, I don't even, it was just so strange, like, what was this all about? And he was just, like, switching up on Tama, like, every two seconds for no reason. And even when he's giving Tama, like, acting advice, he literally makes that dig of, like, hero I was looking forward to having a comic dialogue with a member of my former home. Like, he puts that pressure on him, and then Tama gets freaked out, and then... He goes into, like, the huge storyline with his confidence, which is, like, one of my favourite storylines in A3. And then, you know, it was, like, he just bullied this kid for, like, no reason. And if that wasn't bad enough, then he freaked him out so bad that, you know, Tenma wanted to use the real handcuffs to impress him, and then Tenma fucking dies. And that's all Hero's fault. And nobody talks about this, and it pisses me the fuck off. And then everyone else is like, oh no, your arm, it's broken. And then Tim was like, well, yeah, no shit. And then it's all Hero's fault. And yeah, that's why he's just a fucking arsehole. So, you know. And then we see the scene where he feels so bad about it. And I'm just like, well, you should. You're at fault for it. And then he starts, his main problem with Tema through all of this is the fact that Tema got the role through his parents. As if it was Tenma's choice to be born and be forced into acting at the age of two and be like a fucking Nepo baby. That was not his choice. He just happened to be born in that life. Like, why are you taking it out on him, Take it out on his parents? It's not his fault that he gets privileges because of his parents. Like, he has no control over that. And then he goes on a fucking sob story like, oh, my childhood dream, my childhood dream. Shut up, mate. Shut up. Nobody cares. It's not his fault. And I get it. Hard work, whatever. I don't care. But just shut up. It's it's stupid. And he's like, oh, and then I heard Tama got it through connections. It's not his connections. Like, genuinely, it would be his parents' connections more than anyone else in the agency. Like, how were you pissed off at that? He had no control over that. He just got a role and he was like, oh yes, I accept because it's a good opportunity. How are you 40 years old making fun of an 18 year old for just doing a job and living their life? Then he made Emma so sad and like stressed out about his confidence that he started crying in a field of fucking flowers because someone trip had to take him on a holiday because he was in hospital and his life was shit and it was all Hero's fault. So that's why I hate him and he's a cunt. Obviously, this is all jokes. Like, I don't hate him with a passion, but I just thought it would be funny because we hate Hero here. Hero sucks.